Hello all, Retired by Choice back once again with another fun tablet video. Um, I know it's been a few weeks since I've been on here, sorry about that. Um, life has just been really crazy. Um, my little girl, she's been sick quite a bit, so I haven't really had a chance to make a video. And I really haven't had much of a chance to even be on YouTube. Uh, there's quite a few people I follow and, and watch on a regular basis that I just have not uh, been able to catch up on yet so to those people I'm sorry I will definitely catch those videos uh, either today or tomorrow um, but that's not why I'm here I'm here because I have a fresh batch of pickups I came into a huge stack of PS2 games over this last week or so um, so let me just go ahead and get right into it because I got quite a few games I want to show off First, I want to show off this really cool controller I got. It's a white PS2 DualShock controller. It works great. Um, it looks and plays like it's brand new. I, I paid $5 for it, but I mean, it's in such good condition. And you hardly ever see the white ones out and about, so I figured why not? I'll go ahead and pick it up. Then, this weekend, I went to a estate sale. And they had um, a couple of PS2s for sale. Uh, they wanted fifty dollars a piece for them, which I, I said no way in hell. Even if they marked down to twenty-five, I, I still went at bottom because they're they're the big bulky ones. And uh, fifty dollars or even twenty-five dollars for a PS2 is, is just insane. So I opted not to. But they did have a stack of games there, and I went through them. And the first day, which was a Friday. They had uh, the prices, and they were kind of crazy prices for for PS2 games. And I was like, you know what, that's, that's a little insane. But they had a sign that said, Saturday, everything half off. And I did the math, and I was like, well, I could get almost all these games and still make a pretty penny. So I decided I'd go ahead and, and pick them up. So I went back Saturday morning, was there bright and early, went straight to the games, and this is what I picked up. I got Spyro, A Hero's Tale, it is complete. Now all these games, they all come with the manuals, they all come with the games, and the games, they all look immaculate. I was surprised at how well these games looked. I mean, it looked like someone just bought them, played them once, and put them back on the shelf, and never played them again. Which I wouldn't be surprised if that's what they did. But I got that, three dollars. Got the History Channels, Civil War, A Nation Divided, as I said, complete, $3. Got uh, Gran Turismo 3, it, I'm, it's the greatest hits collection, but it's complete, and I used to have this game when I had my PS2 the uh, first time, and I enjoyed it. I played this game quite a bit. Then. Uh, also for three dollars got Killzone is complete then these next two I got for 250 each uh, Spongebob Squarepants the movie I got this mostly for my kids complete and then I got tied to the Tasmanian Tiger Bush Rescue for 250 and it is also complete then the other ones I got here I picked up sporadically throughout the week from different thrift stores here in Crestview uh, down in Fort Walton Beach, Niceville, Valparaiso, uh, Destin so let me just go ahead and get into those and these are actually I think are, are better than than those I picked up Jax 2 it is complete. It's got a little bit of silver uh, permit marker on there. I need to get off there. Other than that, man, it looks great. I got God of War 2 with the uh, bonus DVD. So it's complete. And it's in really great shape. I got Destroy All Humans 2. Also complete. I got Freak Style, 
this is a fun game. It's kind of like a SSX on motorbikes. It is complete. I remember when this game came out in uh, 2002, I went and picked it up because I saw a, a preview for it somewhere and uh, knew I had to pick it up because it looked like fun. I got Grand Theft Auto San Andreas. It is not complete complete, it's missing the uh, the map, but that's no big deal. And then finally I got Tim Burton's The Nightmare Before Christmas, Oogie's Revenge. It's not complete, it's missing the manual, but this game is fun. I, used, uh, I bought it right before I got rid of all my PS2 stuff, so I didn't get into it a whole lot, but I, I, I did play it quite a bit when I did have it, and it was pretty fun. And that is it for my PS2 pickups. I'm going to have another video up this week, because I didn't just find PS2 stuff. I found uh, Xbox stuff and uh, a few other knick-knack, whack things that I wanted to, to show off are kind of cool. Um, I got a stack of CDs that um, I want to show off, but I don't want to show off, you know what I mean? I don't want to make my videos too long, and they really don't go with the, the game collecting. So I'm, I might show it in another video, separate from the gaming. I don't know. But, um, yeah, that's pretty much it for for uh, the PS2 stuff I wanted to show off. Now I can get these on my shelf. Um, the next video, like I said, is going to be more pickups, but it's going to be more Xbox and whatnot. And uh, the few things I picked up with uh, my good friend, Classic Game Freak in mind, and we already got uh, a trade in process, so anything I show in the next video, they're not for trade, not for sale. So, don't ask! But that is it, so... Um, yeah, thanks for checking out my video. If you like the video, please go ahead and give a big thumbs up. If you don't, that's fine, give a thumbs down. Uh, comment, I try to respond to all my comments, except for the inappropriate children's toys comments. I've already made all the comments I want to make on that, so I'm not going to do any more. I'm done. Um, and uh, subscribe. Always subscribe. I'm at 235 right now. I would love to be at um, 300 by the end of the year. I was hoping to get the 300 by my two-year anniversary, but that's coming up next week, and I don't see that happening unless I go viral, which I don't think will ever happen. So, that's it for me. As always, naughty by nature, retired by choice, peace.